with the help of Addison, I just averted major disaster. Uh, what happened was I locked the keys in the house with Addison in the car and no way to get back in. So luckily, my bedroom window was not locked. That was the only window in the entire house that wasn't locked. I had to rip the screen out. The, the crazy thing about the bedroom window is we have a soft-sided water bed. So the thing weighs about 800 pounds, if not more. This is full of you know, water, obviously, and, and two big bags inside of it. But we've got an iron rod headboard thing, whatever. And it sits right up against the window, so there's like barely any room to get in. So I actually tried to first climb in myself, and yeah, I couldn't make it between the iron rod and the, you know, to get into the window. So I enlisted the help of my assistant, who's picking her nose. Yeah, sure you are. And what she did, I, and I was able to boost her up through, and then she went in and unlocked the front door. So, major disaster averted because we would have had no way to get in. I would have not been able to make it to work. Addison, who has her Easter party at school today, are you excited for your Easter party at school? Yeah. So, I'm nice and dressed up. And she uh, wouldn't have been able to go to her Easter party. So, that would have been a big disaster. We'd have to call Amy at work, who she's probably in court so she can't leave. And we would have just been sitting in the car all day in the driveway. I think I would have gotten in trouble. All right, I'm walking up to my local Starbucks, trying to stay out of the rain a little bit, and got my mug. I'm gonna get my Earth Day coffee. Free Earth Day coffee. Now, let's go to work. I hate the rain. Why is it always raining? What's up? All right, so we are going to see the movie Hop. Are you excited to see Hop? Monkey. She forgot her monkey at home. She wanted her monkey to see the movie with us. Um, right now, Amy ran into uh, the mall. Uh, she had a coupon for a free pair of Victoria's Secret's panties, so she went in and to get... Hey, hey. Get your mind out of the gutter. That's my wife you're thinking about. I'm warning you. So she, uh, she went in to get them. And then we're running up the hill to the movie theater. It's obviously raining, as you can see. And uh, we're going to watch Hop. Oh, I read something recently, too. Uh, for those of you who've been watching for a while know that, uh, that I use T-Mobile cell phone service. And obviously, the AT&T recently is trying to buy T-Mobile. It's going to take about a year for that to go through. Originally... T-Mobile released a statement saying that, you know, they're going to remain separate companies until the merger happens in about 12 months, but uh, that they do not carry the iPhone. Uh, they were definitive about it and said, you know, listen, you know, we will not be carrying the iPhone pretty much. I mean, in not so many words, uh, until the merger actually happens and that's one company. Um, however, uh, a couple days ago, they removed from the, the, the release the fact that they don't carry the iPhone. And, and this kind of coincided with the announcement of the September release of the iPhone 5. So, my fingers are crossed that in September, when they release the iPhone 5, it's obviously going to be on AT&T. Uh, they'll probably have a Verizon version come out. But my, my hope is that T-Mobile is going to get the first taste in, in the U.S. Obviously, overseas, they've already got the iPhone on T-Mobile. But in the U.S., T-Mobile... Uh, we'll finally get their first taste of the iPhone 5, or the iPhone period. So that's, that's what I'm hoping for. I'm really hoping for that, because I want an iPhone. I hate my BlackBerry. I hate it. I don't even have internet on it, I, and I still hate it. Alright, so we just got done watching Hop, and it was a pretty good movie, and now we've got a surprise for Addison, so she doesn't know yet what the surprise is. Are you excited? Did you like the movie? Cool. So Addison liked the movie, so... Mom's running away. Mom's already out the door. She's running. Did you like it, Mom? Yeah. I just dropped Amy and Addison off at the doors there and then parked the car. But the surprise, and I couldn't say anything because Addison was right next to us, is we're going to let her build a EB at uh, Build-A-Bear. So I'm headed into Build-A-Bear. Amy and Addison should already be in there building it or, or in line to build it. So we'll see what, uh, what they're what they've got going on right now. All right, so they didn't have any EBs left in stock, so instead Addison decided to get a different bunny. She's not happy. I'm she's, not happy either. She's being a grumpus. So 
Instead of an EB, we got a daisy flower bunny thing of a bob. She's gonna wash its butt. Don't record you washing its butt? Alright. Can I help you? Alright, so I just wanted to say, as far as the movie uh, Hop goes, pretty pretty decent movie. I mean, it, it had its parts. But uh, the, the one thing that I, I just wanted to, to key on real quick is, is there's definitely a moral. While it's, it's lost on children... Uh, just because it, you know they they're there to watch the rabbit. There's definitely a moral for the adults watching it, and, and I think it, it holds true and, and fits perfectly in what I'm doing here and, and what I want to tell you guys. And for those of you who have seen the movie, you, you probably know exactly what I'm about to say. But make sure that no matter what you do, you follow your dreams. Follow your dreams because if you don't, you're going to be unhappy. And you don't want to be unhappy in life. So, without getting all philosophical on you, that's what I wanted to say. So, make sure you guys thumbs up the video. Don't forget to click subscribe. Make sure you check out all the links down below in the litter box. I just posted a brand new Daily Booth photo today. So, make sure you guys check that out. Uh, don't forget to leave a comment on the video. Tell me what you think. What What is your dreams? What do you want to do with your life? I want to rock! Rock! <laughs> I want to rock, rock. Also check out the Twitter, the Facebook. Check out all that stuff. It's all down in the litter box. You know where it's at. And then as far as that, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. And I'll leave you with, don't let anybody jelly bean on your dreams.